Hi, in this video I will show how to use app for converting QFX files to Excel. This is my website, I will leave a link on this site in the description. To find the app, I will click on search and type QFX and this is the apps page, click on app page and click on QFX to Excel and click on download button to start downloading process and wait until archive will be downloaded on my computer. So QFX is a, a quick and uh, financial exchange format is for uh, format for uh, storing um, information about uh, transactions, financial information about transactions, accounts, and uh, this application will convert it into um, Excel, normal Excel file. So um, you can see app has been downloaded on my com uh, archive has been downloaded on my computer. A quick on downloaded archive, double click on MSI inside archive to start the installation, click on more info here. I'm getting this screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft, you can see publisher unknown. I'll just click run anyway to start installation, click on next, next install, click on yes on this screen and click on finish on final screen. And you can see app has been installed to my computer, I have a new shortcut on my desktop. Now I can close this and this and double click on shortcut to launch app. Conversion with this app is three steps process. On first step, step one, I have to select input files I want to convert. So I will click on this uh, button to select um, my QFX files. I will navigate to folder where this file is stored and click on uh, test QFX. I can select multiple files if I want to. Um, then um, uh, every file will be then on separate spreadsheet in one workbook. So I will convert one file uh, here. I, so I will click on next step. And there are no conversion options here. If you think of any conversion, good conversion options, you can tweak conversion process. Please let me know. I will add them to the next version of the app. Right now I'll just click next step and on final step three I'll just click run to start the conversion. And you can see it's asking me for a uh, name of the file and location. This name and location is okay, I'll just click save. And you can see file has been saved. Now let's go and open the file. I don't have a Excel on this computer, but I have an Excel viewer, Excel mobile. It's kind of like free viewer. It does not allow me to change uh, columns or anything, but it's showing what is inside. If you have fun fully functional Excel, you will be able to change uh, column size and everything any way you want. But we can see there is um, transactions from my QFX test file shown here with uh, all amounts, name, uh, memo, uh, account balance, account name, and account balance on on specific date for, for, for this account so yeah basically that's it this account name and account information will be the same for a group of transactions this is how um, in qfx file information is stored there is an account section and underneath it's transaction section so in order to display it in one table account information will be spread for repeated for every transaction to which account uh, this uh, to which account it belongs yeah, basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments.